Russia produces a huge amount of various special equipment, from agricultural machinery to huge electric excavators. Today, we will tell you about the news in the domestic engineering industry. So, the track released a four-wheel cargo all-terrain vehicle. The Russian company Trackle is a manufacturer of all terrain vehicles with low-pressure tires. They have released a new version of the four-wheeled snowmobile Artika with an open cargo platform. The all-terrain vehicle is designed to transport goods over low load and dense soils. In this case, its load capacity is limited to 2 tons 400 kilograms in the second 4 tons. The all-terrain vehicle is supported by a chassis with the rest of the spar frame. The suspension of all wheels is dependent. The wheel formula is 8 times 8. The double cabin has a sleeping place. It is made of aluminum. The machine is protected by an external tubular frame. The UMZ 534 turbo diesel drives the all-terrain vehicle. The transmission is manual, 5-speed, 2-stage, 3-shaft transfer case, Ural brand. The fuel reserve is 370 liters. To operate the machine, an A3 category tractor driver's license is required. More than 16 million rubles are being asked for a bus on this chassis. The opening of a new assembly and welding shop of LLC, all-terrain vehicles Burlak, took place in Kurgan. Kurgan Enterprise LLC, all-terrain vehicles Burlak, Specializing in the production of unique snowmobile equipment for operation in extreme weather conditions of the far north, the Arctic, and Antarctica, is expanding its production facilities. Another new production facility has been launched in Korgon, this time the integrated production of the company, All-Terrain Vehicles Burlak. In two years, workshops with a total area of about 10,000 square meters were reconstructed and put into operation. New modern equipment has been installed and is working in these workshops. Most of the equipment was purchased with the financial support of the regional government. As of today, 279 new jobs have already been created. It is planned to create another 100 new jobs and build another workshop by 2025 inclusive. More than 20 engineers are already working in the established design bureau of the plant. The faces are all young. The capacity of the workshops allows to produce up to 30 machines per month, and a significant part of the machine park will work in industrial cooperation. Recall that the investment project for the creation of a serial production of a snowmobile in Burlak was launched in 2022 and is designed until 2025. To date, 1.3 billion of the planned 1.6 billion rubles of investments have already been invested in its implementation. At the same time, enterprises actively use government support measures. In 2022 to 2023, more than 142 million rubles of federal and regional subsidies were received. With their help, the company acquired a paint drying complex, universal lathes, metrological equipment, software licenses, a complex of gear milling and gear cutting equipment, a laser cutting machine for sheet metal. In particular, more than 56 million rubles were received for the organization of new production in the form of compensation for the initial payment under lease agreements and in the form of reimbursement of part of the costs associated with the purchase of new equipment. The uniqueness of the company's products lies in the fact that their snowmobiles are able to work in off-road conditions at very low temperatures up to minus 60 degrees Celsius. It is planned to produce up to 30 cars per month within two to three years. The products are well supplied to the oil and gas sector. About 14 vehicles were delivered to the Ministry of Emergency Situations in 2023 under the contract. Tests of the special offshore crane S750 have been completed. SMM Group specialists designed and manufactured three special S750 offshore cranes as part of the import substitution program. At the moment, the tests of one of the cranes have been successfully completed. The tests were carried out on a company-owned test bench with a tipping torque of 5,500 TM, which allows simulating the roll and trim of the crane under test from 5 to 15 degrees. The S750 offshore cranes are designed for operation on ice-resistant stationary platforms. The maximum lifting capacity of the cranes is 45 tons. It fells arrows up to 43 meters, allows you to perform cargo work on the platform and beyond. The lifting equipment of the new series has a number of design features due to the operating conditions in the open sea of northern latitudes at extremely low ambient temperatures up to minus 50 degrees Celsius. To increase the level of reliability during operation, all the main components of the crane are completely sealed. Cargo suspensions are designed with the possibility of short-term lowering into seawater. The design of the cranes uses a coordinate protection system for working in cramped conditions. The mechanisms of the main and auxiliary lifts are equipped with a permanent tension rope system that provides compensation for pitching. SMM Group specialists have obtained a patent for a utility model for this system. The auxiliary lifting mechanism performs the lifting of personnel using special means. The crane's electrical equipment and cargo suspensions ensure operation in an explosive zone, 
eliminating the possibility of their ignition during operation. In the Tomboff region, on the basis of the Titan Enterprise, production of unmanned combines has begun. The project will increase the annual volume of main production to 600 units of equipment and will create 200 jobs. Total investments amount to about 5 billion rubles. The project implementation period is five years. The Tomboff Region Industrial Development Fund will provide preferential financing for a project aimed at import substitution in the agricultural machinery industry. The Titan GS 10 Pro Combine Harvesters are focused on the needs of farms with significant grain harvesting volumes. With the help of an innovative system, fuel consumption has been optimized and a monitoring system has been introduced thanks to which logistics chains have been improved. The harvesters produced will be equipped with a pre-installed parallel driving system, which allows for smooth passage through the field, avoiding gaps and overlaps. The implementation of the project will allow replacing imported agricultural self-propelled machinery with competitive Russian-made models. An agro-industrial cluster will also be created on the territory of this industrial site. It is also planned to launch the production of unmanned aerial vehicles, as well as component bases and spare parts for agricultural machinery. New EKG 12K electric excavators have been put into operation at the Cybantracite Group's mining assets in the Novosibirsk region. Two excavators made in Russia by Iskortex LLC entered the line. One is on the Kolovan section, the second is on the eastern section. Currently, 12 EKG 12K excavators are operating at the group's enterprises in the Novosibirsk region. By the end of the year, for more units of equipment will be put into operation. Three more EKG, 12K electric excavators are operating in the Kemerova region at the Kaizaski section. Chelyabinsk Cran Service has built a fully electric railway crane with a lifting capacity of 25 tons, commissioned by a large metallurgical enterprise. The distinctive feature of the crane this time is the fully electric drive of all crane mechanisms in the absence of a diesel unit. This is due to the fact that the crane is designed to work inside the workshop to avoid exhaust fumes, smoke and noise accompanying the operation of a diesel generator. In fact, the crane functions as an electric vehicle. In addition, the crane is equipped with a frequency control system for all drive mechanisms. Such a system has already become a trademark feature of the cranes of Chelyabinsk Crane Service LLC. It greatly facilitates the operation of the crane improves the accuracy of operation and reduces energy consumption. UMG has introduced another model in the tractor segment of the Russian market. This is a new universal tilled wheeled tractor UMG T1404, which is specially designed to perform various agricultural work with mounted, semi-mounted, and trailed implements for farms and livestock farms, public utilities, as well as for various auxiliary transport operations. A new workshop has been opened at Kazan Selmash, the company produces machinery and equipment for agriculture. He is also actively working on the development of the production of components that are not manufactured in Russia. A number of products necessary for the assembly of self-propelled and trailed sprayers, brake caliper, handbrake caliper, centrifugal water pump, and others have been developed and put into production. The company has a five-axis CNC machine for the production of master models for the production of fiberglass products. As you can see, we produce a lot of different equipment. This is only a small part of what we have found recently.